Yo, what is good everybody and welcome back to the channel. If you have not done so already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you get all my new releases. In this video, we're going to go over the, all the releases for the Europe and US markets for the week of April 11th. So let's go ahead and kick us off with the US releases. I have a couple of in here that aren't your normal Nike or Jordan collabs. I want to kind of go over them because I felt like they were very interesting. So stay tuned for those as I personally think these are going to be a dope sneaker collab. With this being a holiday weekend, it will be a bit slower, but there are still a lot of kicks to get. On April 12th, the Jordan 1 Mid Sand Drift is dropping. It's another Jordan 1 Mid in the Sand Drift colorway. It's not a bad looking colorway. Also on April 12th, there is a really cool Converse and a Cold Wall collab coming out in the Aeon Active. And it is in the Microchip and Black colorway. Now, these are a really kind of unique sneaker, but they do remind me of one particular one, and that's the Nike Adapt. The shape of this really reminds me of them. Uh, they do, don't charge or light up that I know of, uh, but they do look pretty futuristic, so definitely take a look at them. So on the 15th, it's going to be quite busy for the U.S. So to begin, you will have the Nike Dunk Fossil Rose in the men's sizing coming out. And then you will have two releases of the Union Jordan 2s coming out, which is the Gray Fall colorway and the Rattan colorway. I think I mentioned this before in last week's and they unfortunately moved it to this week. So, you know, there you go. But these are definitely a, a must get. They're going to be a hot commodity, and I hope you guys get them, so good luck with those. And now to round us off with the U.S. releases, I thought this one was an awesome release with Reebok and Smiley. It's the 50th anniversary of it, and they're going to put this in a Reebok low with the pump Smiley face. Look at this thing. Tell me that's not dope. Get hype about that. Bring the pump back. So... I've always been a fan of the pumps. Hopefully you guys go out and get these. They're not being released in Europe, but I hope you guys get them because they are a pretty awesome collab. So now we're gonna move over to their European uh, releases for this week. So just like the US release, the collab between Converse and a cold wall with the Aeon Active releases in the Microchip and Black colorway will be releasing. And also for the 12th, you have two different Jordan 1 lows for the women dropping. You have the Marina Blue dropping, and then you have the Gray Pink dropping. Now, I am definitely not a fan of this Gray Pink. You know, those two colors can go well together, but I just don't like them in that shoe. Now on the 14th, there's a very interesting collab between Kawasaki and Adidas coming out. I personally like these. I love the, the bright colors of these. I like the Kawasaki. I've always been a fan. I've never ridden one, but I've always been a fan. And I just really like what they did with this sneakers. It's definitely a dope collab, so definitely go out and get it if you can. Now to finish out the EU releases for this week is the Nike Dunk High in the Flux colorway, which is basically almost a mirror uh, finish on this Nike Dunk High. It is a very shiny shoe. I believe it will sell out. It is a collab between Clot, even though their hype hasn't been what it used to be. I definitely think these will sell out. Am I a fan of them? Not really. I, I just, you know, an all silver shoe is not something that I would uh, probably rock on a steady basis. Maybe a special occasion. That might be okay. But an everyday or even sometimes during the week, it's just not going to happen. So that's going to round us out for this week. As always, I appreciate you guys watching, and I hope you like the content and subscribe and comment, and I hope you have a great week. Take care.